Well, the year is drawing to a close, so let's look back at the music that defined 2019. Spotify, the most popular global audio streaming service, has revealed the top songs and artists from the year. Joining us to break it all down is Spotify trends expert, the lovely Shannon Cook. Welcome. How are you today? <laughs> What an introduction. Thanks, Natalie. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Well, we are excited to chat about this. We love our music, and so let's talk. First off, I think the one that always okay. catches my attention, top artists. I've got some of my favorites, but who are the top artists that you were able to see in 2019? Well, the most streamed artist on Spotify for 2019 was Post Malone. This, is, this guy is one of the most prolific songwriters out there at the moment. Every song that he writes becomes a hit. His music streamed more than six and a half billion times this year, if you can believe that. And in second place is Billie Eilish, our top streamed female artist of the year. She's only 17, but she really breaks the mold of the typical pop star. And people love her. Her music streamed more than six billion times. And our third most streamed artist, of the year is Ariana Grande. She released a very popular album in February called Thank You Next. And our listeners have basically been playing it on repeat ever since then. So big years for those three artists. Well, you brought up Post Malone and you said how every song he seems to do definitely is one of the ones that are leading the way as far as streaming. Was his song one of the most streamed songs of the year? Or, or who? what was the most streamed song? Actually, Actually, no, it wasn't a Post Malone song. Uh, the, the most streamed song is from Camila Cabello and Shawn Mendes. The song Senorita, they're a lovely, steamy collaboration that did really well over the summer as well. Uh, and our second most streamed song uh, is Bad Guy from Billie Eilish. But yes, our third most streamed song is from Post Malone. Uh, one of my favorites of the year, actually, Sunflower. Um, it features the rapper Sway Lee, and the song actually comes from the, the latest Spider-Man movie. It's a really cool song. I really like it. Oh, I liked how you described uh, the first song there is Steamy. I, I would agree with that one. Let's, uh, let's talk <laughs> breakout sure. artists, though. What, uh, what about breakout artists? Who is that on your list? Well, um, our top breakout artists of the year, uh, according to fan engagement, are Lil Nas X, who had that massive hit with Old Town Road featuring Billy Ray Cyrus, and also Lizzo, uh, the rapper, R&B singer Lizzo, has had an amazing year. Uh, really great songs, really clever lyricist and very funny lady. And also there's a, an artist from Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico named Lune, who um, is a Latin trap artist. He's had a big breakout year as well. Latin music is extremely popular. Uh, with our global audience on Spotify. Well, you know, Lizzo was actually just here in Tampa Bay not too long ago, and I know that was a boo. I think she's been here oh, twice nice. even recently, and those are both big concerts here. One thing I always like, though, to pay For attention, sure. it, it trends, you know? We see things come and go mm -hmm. just as long as everything else. What do you guys see at Spotify yeah. as far as trends for the year? Well, we've seen a lot of interest in K-pop, you know, the type of music that comes from South Korea. Um, but also, and this is really encouraging to me, the band Queen has been really popular on Spotify ever since the biopic came out, Bohemian Rhapsody, at the end of last year. Our younger listeners have really been digging into Queen's catalog, and they've had an amazing year on Spotify, which I think is, is really kind of cool. That's very cool. I'm a huge Queen fan. Fan. So like I even got Queen, Queen favorites to set on my list and like satellite radio and, and Spotify. When Queen songs come on, that's all about me. So I love hearing that was a trend. But uh, this has been so educational. Great. I really love chatting with you today. Thanks for joining us. <laughs> Great. I'd love to come back anytime. Deal. Happy, uh, I can say happy 2020, right? <laughs> Absolutely. It's nearly <laughs> the end of the year. It's crazy. <laughs> crazy is right. Well, hey, take care and hope you join us again soon. Thanks, Natalie. Bye-bye.